I'm at Walmart. And, um, just getting everything for this diet. Today is day one, guys. And I'm actually, I could say this morning, I'm excited. Um, I am pretty much done shopping now. And I didn't record because it is busy here today. Crazy. It is really busy for some reason. But I have everything, literally everything that was on my list is in here. And I stayed around my $100 budget. It's $101.80 so far out of everything I have in here. And I give myself $100. So literally got everything on my list. Cross that off. And don't be scared that taco sauce is on this list because let me show you guys. Here's the taco sauce, right? And it's a Taco Bell brand. But if you notice, it's almost zero everything except for sodium. But on this diet, you actually want to have higher sodium intake because of how you're going to feel with this diet. So it's actually a good thing to have on the list. And I got um, eggs, ground chicken, ribs, a roast. I got Marcus steak. I got some salmon, butternut squash, all my veggies. I got ground flaxseed in replacement of flour. Um, that's actually, this isn't that bad a price. It was only like $3 for this big bag. And it's 16 ounces, which is really good. And then we can have our cheeses on this diet. So I got two blocks of cheese. Bacon is good for this diet. And then I got lower sodium. So it's actually zero sodium. And by on this diet, by you not having any carbs, look at this. Total carb zero. So you can eat so much bacon on this diet, which is freaking awesome. Got some shrimp got our butter because you can have that on this diet broccoli kales our salad mixes some lemons mushrooms like the stuff that we typically eat this is I found as well I'm not gonna use a lot of this this is pure sunflower oil is a lot a lot healthier than um, eating um, vegetable or canola oil so and this wasn't bad either it was less than three bucks for this big thing so you know there's some healthy options out there guys and can have heavy whipping cream which is crazy I'm gonna use this for different sauces and stuff because so, if you can see you know there's not a lot of sodium there's more fat in here but you want more fat in this diet and there's no carbs there's less than one gram of carbs in here and you know so it's like this diet is so doable so I'm excited now that I finally got you know everything um, for this diet and you can have like a lot of this stuff like these condiments like mayo and stuff you can have because it's mostly fat um, so you can make your good chicken salads and tuna salads and stuff like that um, dressings you've got to steer from a lot of them do have added carbs but like mayo is like fat you know so you can have it on here because your body your body can break down fat which is really good so um so yeah I am probably just about to check out and I'm really excited to know that, you know, I got all this stuff on the list. I'm staying within my $100 budget and I pretty much have everything on the list except for one thing which we really don't need, which I was looking for pork rinds because you can have that on this diet as well, but it's not necessarily needed. I just put that on there as a snack, but I actually got other snack items like pickles and stuff, so I don't need to get necessarily get it. But, um, but I mean, being able to make a list, sticking to that list, staying within your budget, and getting all of the stuff you need for that diet is freaking awesome. So, um, it is noon now. I haven't eaten yet, um, because I wanted to start the day off with this diet. So, I'm just going to go check out and go home and cook. And I'll show you guys what I cook because this is the first vlog for this diet. So, I'm really excited. So, I'll just see you guys at home. Hey guys, I'm back at home and it's one o'clock and me and Mark are starving because I haven't cooked yet because we wanted to kick start today with that diet. So um, right now I'm just making some bacon and eggs because yes, you can eat those on the diet. You can eat bacon and eggs on the diet. Don't worry, we're not eating all these eggs. It's just in our old carton, there's only one egg left. So I'm just gonna crack all, you know, put all the cracked shells in this and throw it out. So, um, yeah, so right now, like I said, I'm making some bacon and some eggs. And you can have bacon on this diet because 
there's no carbs in bacon. And um, there's actually, since there is quite a bit of fat in bacon, you can have it. Um, because your body knows how to break the fat content down better than it knows how to break the carbs down. So bacon is really good for you on the diet. And let me just take this bacon off of here because I don't want to burn it. Um, and I think for lunch I'll probably have a salad and then for dinner have the taco stuff. But um, so far, feeling really good. I mean, I'm, I'm still tired and I'm really hungry, but that's only because I haven't eaten, so. Um, so yeah, so I've made about half of this pack of bacon and um, I'm gonna save the other half for tomorrow. And then I'm going to, uh, I can wash this bacon off my hands. And as far as, you know, today, the hardest part of today for me is the fact that I'm in a lot of pain already um, since I woke up this morning from... Um, you know, just my normal pain from my diseases, like my left hip is hurting super bad. And, you know, for, for you ladies, I know you men don't really like to hear it. You know, I'm on my menstrual cycle, so that's causing me pain. Um, and also, too, upon doing research for you ladies, if you guys want to um, do this diet, um, it does ch change your hormonal balance in your body um, at the beginning. So you are going to experience, you know, sometimes spot, random spotting and, um, you know, PMS symptoms and stuff like that for, you know, within the first month of this diet because your hormonal balance is changing. So your body's trying to regulate to it. So that's the only downfall for us women, you know, is going to be, you know, having that occurrence within the first month, you know, as well as for people like me who are in pain, you know going through, you know, getting your body into ketosis and, you know, having that ketogenic flu and um, stuff like that, I know it's going to be a lot harder on me because, you know, I'm going to have that on top of my other symptoms, but it's just all about getting through it and, you know, I have, you know, a good support team as well as a support team from you guys, so I, I know I'm going to go through it, I'm going to get, get through it. But our bacon is finished, so I got our bacon done, so now I'm going to go on to Frying our eggs and getting us some food in our systems because I know I'm starving and I know Mark's starving because like I said it's going on 1.30 and we haven't eaten so we're just trying to get our bodies used to it but yeah talk to you in a little bit. Hey guys, oh, um, just thought I'd start vlogging again um, because I'm about to make the second course for today and um, make the... Uh, tacos, the lettuce wrap tacos, and um, cause it's going on four, and um, you know, it's about that time. And we just mutually decided that we would have the bigger meal for lunch and then the smaller meal for dinner, so we have less stuff on our stomach when we go to sleep. Um, so we're gonna have a salad for dinner, but oh god, my body hurts so bad, you guys, it's ridiculous. It's ridiculous how bad my body feels. Like I feel like I got hit by a car. But oh, today you guys are probably gonna see a lot of you know, like I said, food, video, and stuff. Um, especially since this is going to be one of the journey vlogs for my diet, and um, I have you know some basics for it here and I got some the salad right here I got the big leaf the giant leaf um of the Roma romaine hearts just so we can wrap the um wrap the tacos in that instead of the shells so I mean I'm feeling good so far today for it being day one um I mean, I noticed myself getting hungry a little bit faster, um, so you know, uh, that's probably the only downside, but they say, you know, that's when you're supposed to put, you know, more water and more greens, you know, as far as snacks and stuff, so, um, 
so yeah, you know, I had a couple pickles for a snack, um, and so did Mark, um, just to kind of help, you know, subside our stomach from rumbling in the midst between meals, you know, but it's all about learning, you know, what type of snacks and stuff to have. I need a fucking cow. <laughs> yeah, he's going nuts. <laughs> but we had these for a snack, these Milwaukee brand pickles, which I absolutely love. I love these pickles. And they're not, and they're cheap too. So, so yeah, I'm going to get to cooking, to get to cooking these tacos. Yeah. <laughs> um, I, and I'll, you know what? I'll show you guys what I'm gonna do. <laughs> so I can add you as a friend so you know we can keep up with each other and um, yeah it's going good so far you know I still have you know another meal to go for today which I'm gonna you know have a salad with a boiled egg and um, you know and that's gonna be perfect for me before I eat because it's six now so by the time I eat again it's probably gonna be like seven you know eight o'clock almost and you want to eat something small when it gets closer to bedtime so Today is today has been pretty good guys. I'm you know day one down and you know many more to go and I, I'm feeling good. So day one of the rest of your life. Yeah, day one of the yeah, rest Jenny of my life. Not a diet, it's a lifestyle. It's a lifestyle, of course. Yes, and um, you know, and like I said, today's went really good. Thanks you guys for um, you know coming along on this journey with me and you know I, I look forward to making many more of these um, 
vlogs for you guys um, showing my process with this journey so so yeah um, have a great day guys and I will see you guys with a regular vlog tomorrow